Hello and welcome to another DCS video. If you are an aviation nut like me, you might enjoy some of my other videos, so take a peek if you wish. Today we will be doing a weapon overview of the AIM-9X Sidewinder. Let's begin. We will hit the specifications of the AIM-9X first. The AIM-9X functions as an air-to-air -air missile guided by infrared signatures. It costs roughly $381,000 and is contracted to Raytheon. It features a power plant consisting of an MK-139 solid propellant rocket motor that allows the missile to reach a range of around 11.2 miles and a speed up to Mach 1.2. Dimension-wise, it spans almost 10 feet and has a diameter of 5 inches and a wingspan of 17.6 inches. For the second section, we will move on to the history of the missile, as well as a few other things I would like to touch on. The bid for the AIM-9X was originally won by Hughes Electronics. Raytheon fought for the bid and later bought out the defense division of Hughes Electronics. The AIM-9X entered service in November of 2003. Upgrades were quite substantial over previous AIM-9 models. The AIM-9X features compatibility with the JHMCS or the Joint Helmet Mounted Queuing System, which allows for the pilot to fire the AIM-9X by simply looking at the target. Other improvements include range and speed. The motor and the warhead of the AIM-9X remains the same. Finally, let's talk about the AIM-9X and DCS. Please note that the following is only my opinion. The AIM-9X is personally my favorite short-range air-to-air missile to use in DCS. It has a high success rate and almost never misses. Even when the target uses countermeasures, the AIM-9X rarely loses sight on what I'm going after. I actually never use the JHMCS system and always fire the AIM-9X through the HUD. As it stands now, I would like to think that the AIM-9X is the best short-ranged air-to-air missile in DCS. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any AIM-9X information to contribute personal stories regarding the AIM-9X use in DCS or some thoughts on the video, please leave a comment below. I'll make sure to go through them all. I'll catch you later.